Hi guys, it is Sandra here. So I have been talking about getting ready to remodel our house. So I'm gonna kind of show you some of the things so you will for real see. Yeah, we need to seriously remodel our house. And I'm gonna show all the bad stuff. So I'm in Trevor's room right now and I'll start in here and show you some of the things that need to get done. So, back up, it focuses. Okay, this is Trevor's room. He, he needs to make his bed. Anyway, so this is it. First thing I want to do, if you notice the floor, it's those, um, they're not tiles. It's that peel and stick linoleum or whatever. I think we're gonna carpet this room. And then it will just need a fresh coat of paint. We're gonna keep it the same color and trim or whatever, but we just need a fresh coat of paint. We did get window treatments, um, some wood ones, so that's good to go. Um, yeah. Now, if you notice here, this door frame here, let me just show you by trying to open it. This door is shot um, because of this door frame. So if you look here, it's all messed up, all sorts of messed up. I think whoever lived here before us had to break in the door for some reason at some point. So that's another thing we need to work on. Now this is his closet and you'll see there's no carpeting, no nothing. There is tack strips in here. So when we carpet in here, we're gonna carpet in there as well. So that's his closet. It's kind of just for storage right now. So that's his room. That door is good. We just need to put a fresh coat of paint on that as well. So I'm kind of just showing you this is the before of his room and then everything that's under his bed down there. That's all stuff I've been going through and I've had it up for auction on a Facebook site getting ready to sell it. So I'm just keeping it there until the people come to purchase it which I think is going to all be within the next week and then all that stuff will be gone. So here's the before shot of his room. Oh, and I want a different ceiling fan in here. So let me walk over here and kind of see the whole before. Okay guys, so here we are in the downstairs bathroom. This bathroom does not get used. The one thing it does get used for is I weigh myself in the morning. This bathroom needs a lot of work as well. So upstairs we had a leak in our shower, which is why we had to take our whole shower out and it leaked through here. So we had to cut out a bunch of that. So that needs to be repaired. We do have a decent um, vanity or whatever this is called. We just need to put some knobs on. That will stay and that's good to go. The people who lived here before us tried to cut out something. <laughs> for a medicine cabinet and uh, they actually cut into the beam here and that can't be that way. So we're gonna have to repair this and do something with that. The door is pretty good here. Just gonna put fresh coat paint and new hardware on all the doors and just paint that white. Um, that purple was the color the bathroom was before we painted it. And this, it's a mess in here, but this is the linen closet and I mean, this is not dirty. This is clean, it's just that's what it looks like. So we're gonna put a fresh coat of paint on that and clear this out and all that fun stuff. The shower's good, nothing really wrong with that. Just needs some cleaning. Like I said, nobody uses this bathroom so other than to go pee. Now the floor definitely needs to be redone in here. It's pretty, Pretty bad. Um, the floor is clean, so <laughs> you can really tell. It needs new floor. I think we're gonna put tile in here and then some paint peeled off there, so obviously touch up paint and everything too. So that is our downstairs bathroom, and if I can get in the corner, this is the before shot, just so you guys can see. Okay, so we are in the laundry room. This laundry room is really just untouched since we moved in, like literally untouched. We have this thing hanging there, don't ask. Um, so, things that need to be done in this room. I don't know if I'm just going to paint that shelf 
or if I'm gonna put in cabinets, probably just paint the shelf and call it good. And then we're gonna paint the walls because they have never been painted before. The floor in here is the same as the floor in the bathroom. No, that is not stuff on the floor. That is just ruined floor. The door is in good shape. It just needs to be painted and the trim is in good shape. It just needs to be painted. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We have our deep freeze there and you can see the walls really need paint badly. Um, over the past years, we've been waiting to do all our remodel stuff and it definitely needs it and I cannot wait to see it when it is done. So that's the before of the laundry room. All right guys, so this is our downstairs living room. Um, yeah, it's a nice big room. I like the room itself. It just needs work as well. This carpet and the carpet in our bedroom are by far the worst carpets in our house. They are completely, they have stains all over. I don't know if you can see. This isn't just the coloring of the carpet. They're like pet stains from whoever lived here before us. Um, paint is okay. We just need to put a fresh coat on to make it all nice and good. Uh, the trim work is good. We just need to repaint. So down here, it's basically going to be flooring. We have a decent ceiling fan. We need to put some more light bulbs in. So that doesn't need any work. And then uh, this door needs to be painted and something done with it. But this goes to our understairs. Sorry, it's getting blurry. It's having a hard time focusing. This goes to our understairs storage. So we're just going to put new flooring in there and it goes way back there. But that won't be too hard. Get some flooring. And then, oops, let me latch that. That's the laundry room, that's the bathroom, and that's Trevor's room over there. So you can see like on the wall, Jackson had fun with a marker. So yeah, definitely need to repaint down here. The biggest thing that I'm concerned with right now is this door. Can you guys see? You can see light through there. And see how it's dented and it's just really bad. So we need to fix the door frame on here as well. As far as we understand from what our neighbors have told us is this is where the SWAT team had to come and break in this house for the previous owners. They were into some drug stuff. So um, we actually live in a really nice neighborhood so don't think that we're like in a really bad neighborhood or anything. But whoever lived here before us uh, was not <laughs> doing good things. So the outside of this door the door jam is totally, totally bad. It does lock and everything, but like I said, you can see the light coming through. It definitely needs repairs. That's gonna take some um, elbow grease and some work on our end to fix the door jam and then put a new door with new hardware on that. So yes, this room, door, fresh coat of paint, and flooring. We have yet to decide if we are going to do carpet or um, laminate, wood, whatever. We're not sure. So let me back up and I will show you the before. There's my lucky ducky. So here is the before all over there. Now carpeting has to be done everywhere. You can also see there's stains here. These are clean but they are stains from when we moved in and yeah it's driving me nuts. I'll walk up and over here. Um, don't mind my mess in here because we are going through everything and um, you know they say it always gets worse before it gets better. So I'm bagging up things to donate and going through stuff that I don't need and whatnot. So this is our entryway. Entryway door is good there, door is good there, and our front door is good. Just everything needs fresh coat of paint in here. Walls need good paint, um, and then our flooring, like it's missing a chunk of flooring here. So that is the entryway. Like I said, please don't mind the mess. We are in the process of doing a major, major cleaning through here. And this is another room that's never been touched. See our blanket over our window? Yeah, we have Thomas the Train blanket. It is a nice arched window there too. It gets super hot in here, so Chris couldn't stand anywhere. Put a blanket up until we get new window treatments in here. 
Flooring needs to be done in here. This place actually needs some trim work. As you can see, it's missing a corner piece. The walls are horrible, horrible, horrible. Um, there's no closet door here. There is some shelf stuff in here, but so everything in here is going to be flooring, trim work, paint, and ceiling fan and window treatment. So I'll back up. You can see the whole room before. And this door is good too, it just needs paint and new hardware. I think we're gonna carpet this room as well. Oh, and in the entryway here, we are probably going to put tile down. Okay, now we're in Jackson's room. You see me doing lots of logs in here, up against the crib. So, one thing that's gonna pop out right away is we need trim. The trim was shot when we came here. So we're gonna put trim in. Uh, the blinds are good, we got the wood blinds. They're in good shape, we just need to clean them. Uh, the flooring, here you can see like a red stain. If it wasn't for that red stain, this carpet would actually be pretty good. But we do plan on replacing the carpet and trim. As far as the wall color goes, you can see Jackson, that same day he got that marker, he did that. We got a dent there. We're missing some paint there. What we plan on doing in the boys' rooms is everything is going to be that beige color for now in case we decide to sell in the future. And I don't want to have to paint and paint and paint and paint. So that's that. More marker. Yay. The closet needs some trim work and a door. Actually, I think it just needs a door and then the track will go under there. So I really like how I did my closet. I tell you guys, I think that looks really nice. So anyway, that is his room, and over here, our dog got locked in here one time and scratched the crap out of this. I can sand that down, and we'll just paint this door and keep it, and then put new hardware on. I do have this in here right now, because Jackson was playing in here with his brothers, so I could get some work done, and he kept wanting to get out, and I said, why don't you guys just put the lock on, because they know how to get out of here, but Jackson doesn't. It was easier that way. They could keep an eye. So... This is the before of his room. Kind of just pan around. Thought it'd be kind of interesting for you guys to see a full video of the before and then the after when it is finally done. So that's the before. Okay, this is Parker's room. It's a bit of a mess. He is, <laughs> you know, he's eight years old. What do you expect? So. Same thing in here, carpet's not too bad, but there is like, that is not a pea stain or anything that looks like paint to me, I'm not sure. It was here when we moved in. So we are going to be putting new carpet in. We are going to be painting the walls the same color as the rest of the house. Um, trim work needs to be done in here, just like in Jackson's room. Parker does not have a door at all, so we have to get a door for that and a door for the closet. And yeah. So, we do have the blinds, but two little pieces broke, so we'll probably get new blinds too. And the same day with the marker, while I was in the shower. So yeah, that's pretty much Parker's room. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard, paint, trim, carpet. So I'll back up, you can see a full before shot, and there's the ceiling fan, so yeah. Now, in the hallway, we are going to do new carpeting as well, but here is our um, linen closet door. This was like this when we moved in, so we are going to put a new door and new hardware in here. So that's kind of how that goes. Okay, this is the boys' bathroom. Hi! So I'm going to kind of just show you what needs to be done here as well. Um, oh, the downstairs bathroom, if you notice, it didn't have a mirror, so we're going to have to do something about that. Um, yeah, so just a fresh coat of paint in here and new flooring. I need to get rid of that hose because we don't use the diaper sprayer anymore. Um, I'm not sure what we're going to do about this. So I want to refinish all their cabinets, but on the inside, if you look, whoever lived here before us had fun with some writing. <laughs> And same thing up here is whoever lived here before took the medicine cabinet, so we're going to put a new one of those. And then new light fixtures is what we want to do. 
the door on the bathroom is good. It just needs a fresh coat of paint and new hardware. So <clears throat> that's the bathroom. Dun, dun, dun. The master bathroom. We got a good start on demo and then things went south and we had a bunch of unexpected expenses. My van broke down, et cetera, et cetera. And this is how it still is. So this will be the biggest before and after in our house that you'll see. We are keeping the same tub. That bag has some construction type stuff in it. Um, this is where our shower will be and where our toilet will be. So obviously we're going to need to paint floor, put in a shower, do the shower surround. We have not yet decided what we're going to do there. Um, there's our what you call it skylight thingy majigger and then we'll probably just keep this this needs to be repaired and um, refinished and then we saved the mirror out of here it was one huge big 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 mirror that went across the whole thing and I am going to try to figure out a way to cut the glass and frame it myself and make two mirrors out of it instead of one huge mirror and then we'll need a new medicine cabinet and trim. <laughs> Jackson's laughing. And the door is actually good. It just needs paint and hardware. So this bathroom obviously is not in use either. And you can see here there was a that oops sorry it's like light right there. There was a huge mirror there too. So nobody comes in here. This is actually the first time I've been in here for a long time. <laughs>